It's January 17th and I've been keeping my eye out uh, watching this tree since spring and we had a really weird summer after I repotted it. Um, it seems to uh, not do well with the sudden change of the weather. We had the smoke, the ash, and then we got some sun. It was just really dramatic changes within, you know, the summertime. So this tree, usually we do a, we call it a, <laughs> we call it a, um, a, a bark test. Um, so what we do is we test the tree to see if it's still alive and you see i've been i've been testing it and today i wanted to do the test again so you can see what i mean by you know doing a a bark test to see if it's alive so you don't want to do the branches out here you want to pick near the trunk anywhere and it's going to leave a scar so when you decide to do this test you have to be sure that are you patient enough um, before you actually do the test you don't want to make a, a scar when it's too early to test so let's say right here <laughs> that was my baby <laughs> he's just so you cut in you can see that it is brown does that look alive or dead, dead. yeah Dead. Yeah. Okay, now we go in a little deeper. Very deep. And you can see, you you should, right after this one, you should see green right away. I'm not gonna injure a healthy tree for you so you can see that. But then, sometime, this top part is dead, but the bottom is alive, so that is alive so the rootstock will still be used but the, um, the top will be removed so this is the scion where I was grafted let me see where I can see the graft line right here okay right here you can see oops sorry that's where they grafted it so what I would do is trim off sorry I have my bat baby on my carrier there you go this part will, can be reused to graph over it and so this is a native uh, american um rootstock so that's what we use to graph a um a selective variety of asian persimmon and usually with persimmon, you want to wait until um, June before you do this test. Anything earlier, when you see no bud, it's just too early. But this tree's different. I've been having it for a while. It's been three years old, um, and I've been watching it decline in health. And I know it's because of the transplant shock during the summer. So that's why I'm doing this test um, right now. Otherwise, if it's a new tree you get, you should wait until june to actually do this test um they do bud out quite late um the first year you plant it in the ground for asian persimmons 